Hello, so today we are going to do a color analysis on you. So I will basically use um, kind of fabric that I will be putting on your shoulders mm -hmm. and we will look if it basically suits you well. So okay. what we are looking at is the reflection that it gives to your face. Okay. This means that uh, we have basically cold colors and then we have warm colors. Uh, the cold colors have kind of blue undertone mm -hmm. and um, the warm ones have a yellow undertone. Mm -hmm. um, it reflects on our basically face and uh, the color of the face. Sometimes it can make you too yellow or maybe a little bit too bland basically. Mm -hmm. So we will look at what suits you the best, okay? Okay. Perfect. So I will just look at you now. You're wearing your makeup, but that does not really matter at this moment. It's just a bit. Okay, and it also seems to be of the same color as your uh, skin on the chest is. So that should be fine. All right, so we will start with basically trying to uh, realize whether you are a warm colored person mm -hmm or cool colored person. I will use these swatches and look at what suits you the best. So this is what it looks like without any color, okay? Mm -hmm. This is what it looks like with the uh, nice gold. I'll just leave it there for a bit. And I think it looks really good. It doesn't make you too yellow, it more like gives you color to the face. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't make you look bland and it doesn't make you too yellow. So I think that really suits you well, which could mean that you would you might be perfect for warm colors. Mm -hmm. Let's look at this now. Okay. Okay, if you look at this, it makes you look a little bit too bland and pale. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't make you look very good. So what we are going to focus on is mostly the warm colors, but we will also try um, the cool ones mm -hmm. uh, because sometimes uh, some cool ones can look still still look good, you know. Mm -hmm. So I will first start with brown colors. They are neutral and every time at least one of those colors suits to everyone. We will also look if darker colors or a lighter color suits you better. So we'll just prepare these swatches. Make them even. Okay. So this is what it looks like. This is spring color. Mm -hmm. It nicely gives you color. It also really makes you look great, in mm -hmm. my opinion. I really like this one on you. Like I would wear it every day if I were you. It's like oh. really nice. It was from the spring one, so mm -hmm. it was a warm color. This, on the other hand, is from summer, summer palette, which means that it's a cool one. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't make you look bad but it doesn't make it look like extremely good either. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Good now we have the autumn mm -hmm. which basically is again a warm color. So I kind of like this on you but I would say that the first one was better. Mm -hmm. It's not particularly bad but it's not like awesome either. Okay, now this one. This one actually I think really suits you well. Mm -hmm. It gives you a really nice warm uh, tone on mm -hmm. the face if you look at it and it also kind of uh, enhances the color of your eyes and also mm -hmm. gives a nice contrast with your hair. Mm -hmm. So I think that actually looks really really good on you. Also it looks really nice with the lips of the color if you look at it. Yeah, true. So this one I will take, this one is again from the yellow uh, kind of spectrum, um, 
it's it's, too dark. it's not bad but uh, again yeah it's too it's too dark as you said yeah not bad but I wouldn't go for it like every mm. day yeah all right so now let's go to purple so so far it seems that you are so far it seems that you are uh, on, a, on the warmer scale of the colors so what we have now is purple so this purple is from summer it is cool one mm -hmm. i actually like it on you still it mm -hmm. gives you a really nice contrast with the hair it kind of goes with your eyes yeah, quite like as well. quite well mm -hmm. um yeah probably would not be my like first choice from all the colors that we tried so far mm -hmm. but i definitely would not hesitate to try it on mm -hmm. Okay, so this one is from um, Spring, which again makes it a yellow basically tone. And again, I would say that it actually suits you again like really well. It also kind of seems like it's kind of purplish blue, mm -hmm. so that it's not only like purple, but it's kind of with a blue undertone, but yellow undertone as well. So uh, I would say that this really like looks a little bit like your eyes. Mm -hmm. So True. it makes them really like pop out. Yeah, really looks nice with your hair as well. Maybe doesn't go that well with the color of your lips. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the last one is this one. And this one is a yellow based again color. I don't like it. Mm -hmm. You don't like it? Mm -hmm. I actually a little bit do. It again gives the ni nice contrast with the hair mm -hmm. because it's darker. It's in the yellow undertone, so um, the skin looks quite nice. Mm -hmm. It's really dark, but it's not as dark as the brown that we tried before. So I think it suits you quite well. Like you wouldn't have to like wear it uh, very often but um, usually in autumn uh, they sell in stores uh, quite dark colors mm -hmm. so if I True. were to choose I would probably choose this one mm. okay. okay but of course do not feel pressure <laughs> to wear it if you don't feel like wearing it <laughs> uh, in the end it matters only like if you like it or not so what we will try now is blue and I actually think that blue will look really good on you because you have blue eyes so it should enhance the color of your eyes so I'll just put it on the shoulders like this and this one even though it is from um, like cooler base basically I would say that it suits you well mm -hmm. It doesn't make you look extremely pale and uh, the lighter color really suits you well it makes you kind of like shine mm -hmm. so uh, you look you look like you know um, you really like pop mm -hmm. in that color you know yeah. Um, yeah and in the lighter ones overall this one is from the color spectrum as well but as you can see it is a little bit different mm -hmm. uh, it is from the winter season and I don't particularly like it. I think that it's too um, pale. Too pale. Yeah, it's definitely too pale for you, and it makes uh, your face even look pale. Mm -hmm. So I would not recommend this color. So this one is a dark one. It enhances the color of your eyes definitely. It also gives nice contrast to your um, to your lips. Mm -hmm. Nice contrast with your hair. I probably don't like the color itself, mm. but it suits you well. So like this, and then this one. Um, I don't really like it that well. Me either. Yeah, it doesn't look extremely bad, but it just does not suit you at all. Not to the color of your eyes, mm. not to the color of your lips, and maybe to the color of your hair. But that's about it. And the skin just looks 
weird. Weird. Yeah, it looks pale again, and I don't, I don't really like it. Okay, so we will go to. We will go to. So we have brown, purple, blue. We will go to green or pink. Let's go for pink first. So this one is from the color base again. It makes you a little bit paler, but I would say that it quite suits you nice mm -hmm. still. As I said, even though you are uh, more prone to uh, warm colors, mm -hmm. it does not mean that you cannot wear um, all, you know, uh, the lighter co cooler colors. Yeah, so let's just look at another color. So this one is again cooler it's from the winter and again i don't like it it makes you too pale previous the, was better the previous sure. was definitely better especially also because it has like more saturation to it mm -hmm. so these like really pale colors does not suit you mm -hmm. well at all okay this is from the summer again it has a cooler tone which is interesting because i would say that it makes you look a little bit more yellow yeah me too yeah so that's actually uh kind of strange uh <laughs> however i really like this color on you it looks um a little bit like your lips mm -hmm. uh it maybe does not enhance your the color of your eyes that well mm -hmm. but it looks really nice so again i would not hesitate to take this color so this is a cooler one again I don't mind it again it goes well with your lips it maybe uh, makes your eyes look um, your eyes maybe seem a little bit red if you look at the yeah. bottom of your right yeah, yeah it makes okay. you red in that area which is kind of strange yeah. I never see that actually happening in anyone else uh, so it kind of seems that your eyes are, are a bit red in yeah. reality. It is true. Yeah. That's so um, maybe I would really consider if I would wear this color or not. Mm. <laughs> All right. And this one is just no from me. <laughs> I don't like it at all. It doesn't suit you well. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to green okay and i actually think that green will suit you well because if we look at your eyes it seems that they are blue but have a little bit of hint of green as well mm -hmm. so it could really enhance the green color in it so this is spring color warmer tone it instantly gives you if you look at it it instantly gives you color mm -hmm. to the face. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It looks quite nice. The green itself is not that pretty, I would say. Mm -hmm. But it makes you look good. It goes well with your lips, again, with your eyes, and also with your hair. So maybe this would be worth a try. It doesn't, also, it doesn't steal attention from you. It still like attracts the attention to your face and not mm -hmm. to the color. This is a cooler, uh, cooler color. I don't particularly mind it, but I probably would not choose it either. Mm -hmm. This is a warmer color from the autumn. Maybe for a wedding it would look nice, but also I would say that it makes your eyes red. look red. Again. Again, like at the uh, bottom line, basically. Mm -hmm. This one is really pretty on you, I would say. I like it. It goes nice with your hair. It, 
there is like not much contrast between your hair and mm -hmm. uh, and the color itself uh, but I like it on you it does not like attract the attention to it it again mm -hmm. brings the attention to your face so like this and the last one is this one and no the winter colors does not suit you well at all yeah. like it it uh, makes your eyes pop out but True. that's about it yeah all right okay okay so now let's go to we unfortunately have only one red hair which is which is in the spring, spring so warmer tone that usually suits you well and I would say that it should be right but if you look at the color of your face it makes you look pale not pale but too orange also it again enhances the red underneath your eyes mm -hmm. and it just makes the cheeks I will just remove it now okay if you look at your face now it has like a normal neutral a little bit yellowish color but if we bring this it just enhances the orange in the cheek area mm -hmm. and also on your forehead. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Also, uh, it makes the uh, bottom line of your uh, eyes nice. look red. So I would not say that it suits you like really well. Yeah. All right. Now we have orange. We have many of oranges, which, which actually should suit you well because if you look at the color wheel you usually have or we have opposite colors that like complement each other and the blue, blue and, the and orange. orange are at the opposites which means that it should bring a nice contrast mm -hmm. so let's look at it so this is from the spring season mm -hmm. i would say that it so it's you quite well. It makes your um, face look a little bit more orange again, mm -hmm. but not to uh, the extent as the red did. Mm -hmm. So I would say that this actually looks quite well. This one is from the spring uh, season again, but I don't really like it on you that well. Somehow it makes you look pale mm -hmm. on some sides and I don't really like the contrast between your hair and the color. Mm -hmm. It seems like your hair are too cool uh, with the yellowness of this color. Mm -hmm. This one on the other hand suits you really well. It does not make you look orange at all. It makes your face look really normal. It also enhances the color of your eyes again. Mm. Looks really well with your lips. So I would say that this one is probably the best one so far. Mm -hmm. Then we have this one. It's from the uh, autumn season. Again the eyes. Again I the eyes. Like yeah. Are not okay. Yeah, but it doesn't make you look like particularly bad, but it's not like extremely good either. Mm. Okay, and this is it. You will go to the yellow. So this is the spring season. It's a little bit pale, mm -hmm. even though it's in yellow undertone, I would say that it makes your face look pale mm -hmm. a little bit. Otherwise it doesn't, it does not look bad, but it makes you a little bit uh, whiter in the face. Mm -hmm. That's about it. Otherwise it looks really good. And the second one? No, no. not at all. That looks terrible. <laughs> Like, frankly, <laughs> you know, I don't really want to lie to you because if you would like one day take this color and I would say it does not look that bad, it would look horrible and I do not want to be the person that caused it. 
All right, if we look at this now, this is white and it is in the color tone. It makes your uh, face look a little bit pale, mm -hmm. but otherwise I would say that, uh, you know, like white suits almost to everyone. True. So if you want to wear it, just, just <laughs> wear it. And then we have this one. It's in the cooler color. It's gray and I'm not enjoying it. Mm -hmm. It does not look bad, but it does not like enhances anything on you. Okay. And this is it. So now we'll just make a collection uh, from the colors we chose and we will try them on to let you see uh, the ones that just look perfect on you, okay? Okay. So as first we have here the gold color. And if you look at it, it just makes you look really good. I like it. Okay. Then we have here the brown color. And I really love this color on you. Yeah, it looks like extremely well. Mm -hmm. I really like it a lot. Probably maybe my top three color. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this one definitely. That we have here orange. So we chose two orange colors. Mm -hmm. So this one is a little bit more saturated than the one that is going to come and still looks really great on you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now this one. I probably like this one a little bit better okay. than the previous one. Maybe because it's not that saturated. Mm -hmm. Okay. That we have here pink one mm -hmm. that is from uh, from the cooler colors mm -hmm. so this one is the only one probably or maybe not the only one I think that even uh, the second pink that we had actually suited you well even though it was from the color base so I really mm -hmm. like this one on you then we have it's called neutral red but I don't see any red in it yeah so it was supposed to be, I remember this one, it was supposed to be a cooler color, but it strangely gives you a uh, warm undertones. Mm -hmm. So I really like this one on you. It goes really well with the lips. Then we have here a green one. Looks well. I would not wear it every day, but as you can see, you have kind of, um, even only you have it's something between green and blue mm -hmm. and it really goes well it's not that saturated this one was extremely saturated mm -hmm. but i think that these like paler colors would look great on you mm -hmm. now we have the blue it's from the color spectrum but looks really nice goes well with the hair not my most favorite. This one looks well. It's it looks nice. it looks as your eyes basically. Mm -hmm. It looks of the same color to me in the reflection in the mirror. Then we have this one. I really like this one on you, even though it's dark for some reason all picking color looks really great mm -hmm. this one from the cooler spectrum I love it maybe it's just the color that I love but it I feel like it suits you really well. Like it as well yeah and this is probably like in the top three that I like the best on you as well and mm -hmm. it's this one it just like really complements your eyes, your lips, your hair and the skin, mm. the tone of it. 
really like probably one of my best pick i would say mm. yeah all right so this is it hope you enjoyed it thank you very much okay perfect and uh definitely if you want to i can give you uh some samples of the colors uh you know home so that when you go shopping you can actually like look if the color is the same and so on okay okay perfect thank perfect. you so much yeah no problem mm -hmm.